I just put it in God's hand. 21 years in prison, then another two decades registered as a sex offender. I have been waiting for this day. Mallory Nicholson is finally a free man. She asked me one question 20 years ago almost. Did you commit this crime? I said, no. She said, well, that's good enough for me. It's time for us to roll our sleeves up and start this fight. That fight came to a close Thursday when Dallas County Judge Chica Anayam made his exoneration official. I apologize. I wish you well. In 1982, two young boys told police a male suspect stole items from a nearby apartment and sexually assaulted them. Despite there being no physical evidence, Nicholson, who alibi witnesses said was at his then wife's funeral, was arrested and charged based on eyewitness testimony. There's no question in our minds that once again, this man is innocent. The Innocence Project brought Nicholson's case to the DA's Conviction Integrity Unit, which determined that evidence of another suspect, a 14-year-old boy named Coco, was never shared with defense attorneys. We have independent evidence that this person, Coco, existed. And we also have evidence that some of the acts that were described, he actually did that in other cases. The only problem is Coco's dead. After 40 years wrongfully convicted, Nicholson can finally start his new life. Eat a good meal today and in Dallas. Kiss my loving wife for being so supportive. I'm Ariel Placencia.